Okay, hey guys, uh, it's Monkey again. <laughs> this is only the second time doing this. Uh, the first time I did something wrong, and it didn't look good at all. So we're going to make blimps today. And because today is t second day of uh, uploads of the week, it's kind of early right now, so I'm kind of out of it. But right now we're going to try and make a blimp like this, like a nice huge blimp. So uh, we'll go over to some flat area, and we'll go uh, go to your brush and make it sand and then uh, you're gonna make it fairly big 20 should be okay so we're gonna put it up in the air okay and then you're gonna save it with control s and then we'll be back in like two seconds on the uh, on minecraft okay okay so um today i just told you how to put this uh... ball down this giant sand thing now what you're going to do is go to the bottom, and with the physics of the sand they have in this game, this should all fall. And this is probably going to lag really bad. Uh, looks like an ice cream. Nice. And just got to give it a second or so. Uh, <laughs> okay, it's almost done. Slightly laggy though. Um... You just gotta give it a bit of time and it should come out like that. But you see there's that one piece of sand that you destroyed is right here. So put that back down. Ugh, I've got fly too fast. Um, so that's what we have right now. Okay. So you're gonna save and quit. I'll be back in a second. Okay, hey guys, we're back in uh, MC Edit. And uh, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go and select all your... Th all of the... Uh, uh, all of your uh, sand. I think it's here. And we're gonna go select it all. Okay. okay so right about there. Okay. So if you wanted just a simple one like that, you would go fill and replace, and put sand, and then go replace, and then make it whatever you want. If you want it uh if you want it full, so that's what it'll be like, it'll be full. But if you want it to be hollow, like, uh, wait till it loads. If you want it to be hollow, like, I think this one's hollow. Yeah, if you want it hollow like this one, just follow what I do. Okay, so you're going to do a filter, topsoil, uh, topsoil, <laughs> topsoil, and then you're going to go whatever color you want. So let's make it red, just so it's bright and red. And then you're gonna put depth, we'll put it to four. And you're gonna put filter. And now what that did is we're gonna keep doing it until every spot down here is full. So that's what we have right now, this thing. And then you're still thinking there's sand inside, so we're gonna do fill and replace sand. And then replace with air. So then do replace. And then you're gonna go under. You're gonna go under it. It does not like this. Okay, so we're gonna do uh we'll just nudge it up. Okay, so now we have this selected. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna do uh clone and then you're gonna um I think it's roll maybe. Yeah, and that'll bring it sideways. Okay, so that's what you have right now, so you're gonna finish cloning it. And that's all it is right now is this hollow little red thing. Now what you're gonna do is drag uh, your thing so you only have like the edge selected. It is not like me selecting those for some reason. Uh, so you're gonna go over here, and then you're just gonna pull that down straight so you can get all this red outer edge of it, and that should be good. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna do a uh, clone, and then you're gonna pull this back a bit and put it around right so it's matched with that you can also see that it lines up here too but you want to make sure it lines up with that right in there so then what you want to do is you want to make it however long you want it to be so we can put it like 20 and it'll be that long plus another end of it so I think we could put a bit more so we'll probably go around 40 and that looks about right so clone that and just wait till it loads um, it's MC Edit's a really good program for big projects. Um, yeah, 
So now what you're going to do is you're going to have to select what's back here. So you're going to go there and all the way down. And this is just kind of a random one so you can see what we're getting at. Um, then we'll clone. Then you have to roll it, rotate it twice, so E and then E. And then this should line up with this if we line it up. <laughs> it should line it up if we line it up. But if we don't line it up, it won't. So, there we go. It's all lined up. And then you're going to want to import it. Or clone it, I mean. And there you go. You have a balloon-shaped thing. <laughs> if you want to go inside it, you can tell that it's all hollow. Uh, they select that. It's a nice, huge, hollow type thing. And you can add things to it, like, uh, you can add an undercarriage to it and such. Uh, if you want to do that, you just select an area down here, and then go across, and then, uh, we'll go about there. And then you're going to go fill and replace. Um, wood, it's like iron wood, yeah, that's it. And then you're going to fill with that. And that's about all. <laughs> so right now you just have to go into single player. And uh, just go work with it. Um, this we're just deleting the inside of it. Two layer down. So right now we have this part. Oh, we lost the bottom. Uh, oh no, we can add a bottom too to make it a bit more different um, so that's about right um, and it's broken yeah right here it's supposed to be able to select that but it doesn't like me I'm guessing yeah you guys should be able to do that but I can't for some reason so I'm just gonna put it with wood and I'm just gonna delete this back end of it There you go, guys. There's your inside. That's not long enough. <laughs> I'm just running in problems today. Um, let's go this way. Um, fill and replace with the red ironwood. And then deselect. And s you're going to save it. You're going to want to constantly save it on this, but um, I'll show you something that I've built with it. And then all you have to do is go into single player, just fix it up. That's just a really basic one, but there's like some random ones that you can work. This one is just, I did this before the video to make sure I knew I could do something about this because there's nothing about blimps in Minecraft. So there's ours over there. So I'll show you another one that I've done. It's on my, uh, the adventure map I'm working on. Uh, still looking for a name for it, so I just called it the quest for now. Uh, this is getting around 10 minutes, so I'm going to hurry and rush over there. Deselected something. This is all secret. You can't see any of this. None of it. Here it is, right here. So you can add like propellers to the side, straps on it with a huge cover on it, and you can build like an undercarriage with like all the things. These purple things are actually uh, fences, but because it's in MC Edit, it doesn't pick up fences that well. I've got a flag on it and such. And that's something for the adventure map that I needed to do, and I needed a tutorial for today. It was either this or a uh, Photoshop tutorial, but there's about a couple hundred of them. So if you guys do have problems with Photoshop, just tell me and I will make a series of them. And here's our forest. Uh, you guys didn't see this in the last video. I also added uh, a castle up in the sand so you can get up there. And then I also added the forest on the floating islands. What happens is the roots went like crazy on it. And it kind of looks good, but it kind of looks crazy. And then I just put a camp here for now. I wasn't really sure what to put. And the next is the steampunk type city area that I haven't finished yet. I've just done this blimp. And so that's, that's about it, guys. So I'll see you next time, whenever that may be. But that's just an easy tutorial on how to make a blimp in Minecraft.